The Rockford Ice Dogs wrap up their two-game at Texas road trip tonight as they rematch against the Texas Stars at HEB Center in Cedar Park. Joseph Zakrzewski back with you for Ice Hogs TV as we take a closer look at tonight's matchup with your Ice Hogs game preview. The Ice Hogs and Stars rematch from an evening ago, and the Ice Hogs with a 3-1 victory entered tonight with an 11-9-1-1 in -one record, and they sit in third place in the Central Division and now have points in seven of their last nine games. For the Texas Stars, they are 7-11-3-1 entering tonight's play, seventh in the division, and are trying to snap a five-game winless skid. The Hogs building off a hard-fought 3-1 victory against the Texas Stars last night. They would score two goals in the first period off the first three shots of the game for them, and they were off to a great start. For Dylan McLaughlin would score at the seven-minute mark, and 30 seconds later, Alex Nylander would follow with his team-leading eighth goal of the year. Goaltender Colin Delia was stellar in that first period, making it 12 saves. The Ice Hogs would only allow 12 shots in the second and third period combined and hold Texas to just five shots in the final frame, including that late-game push. And the big news for the Ice Hogs coming out of last night's contest is that Delia would become the first Ice Hogs goalie in their AHL history to be credited with the goal as he would find the empty net with three seconds left. For the Texas Stars, they hope to escape out of this five-game skid they are on, 0-3-2 entering tonight. Tonight's game number five of an 11-game homestand, but when they woke up this morning, they realized that tonight would be their final game before the Christmas holiday break as their two games next week against Manitoba have been postponed due to COVID-19 concerns surrounding the Moose. But during this skid, they have been outscored by their opponents 22-10 over the last four games. Defenseman Ben Gleason scored the lone goal last night for Texas, and netminder Anton Hudobin in his AHL season debut would provide 29 saves. In the head-to-head -head tonight is the fourth of eight meetings between the two clubs this season and the last game in Texas. The Ice Hogs will host the Stars at the end of January and February. And with the win, the Ice Hogs are 2-1-0. and oh. Defenseman Ben Gleason leads the overall series with four points. He's got a goal and three assists against Rockford. And on the Ice Hogs side, defenseman Nicholas Bodane paving the way with three assists against the Stars. Let's take a look at the Lou Backroad Automall three keys to the contest for your Ice Hogs entering tonight. And key number one is to get their feet moving early. The Texas Stars had a great push in period number one. The Ice Hogs did grab the first two goals of the game, but the Stars certainly had their chances, and Colin Delia would have to make 12 saves, the most he'd have to face in a single period an evening ago. Key number two for your Ice Hogs is to own the neutral zone. That's the same key we had in key number three of last night's contest. And boy, did the Ice Hogs perform magnificently. The Texas Stars love to use their speed to enter the attacking end, but the Ice Hogs they were able to put up a wall in the neutral zone, be physical, and at the same time force turnovers and have the puck move in the other direction. And key number three for Ice Hogs is to continue to have active sticks against this Texas Stars bunch. They moved the puck around quickly, and many times last night the Hogs got their stick right in the passing lanes, able to intercept, force turnovers, and get the puck moving the other direction. The Ice Hogs look for the weekend sweep against the Texas Stars this evening as they rematch at HEB Center. Puck drop is at 7 o'clock Central Time, and you can catch all the action right here on the Ice Hogs Broadcast Network, presented by BMO Harris Bank. Thanks for tuning in to today's Rockford Ice Hogs Game Preview.